Welcome back everybody. I'm just going to touch on a couple of things that have uh, been going on around and get those off my plate so I can uh, erase my video memory card. Well here's Robert's garden for this year. Uh, we've got some sunflowers and we've got corn and the corn's coming up pretty good. It seems to be resisting the heat and over here in this other patch he, he actually did three patches this year we got squash and we've got string beans or peas sorry and uh, next to the peas off to the right we got uh, onions so we got some onions growing got some uh, peppers I believe they're jalapenos and we've got some carrots hopefully we won't have gophers this year now we turn to hummingbirds. Well, we've got plenty of those around. You know that hummingbirds are the only birds that can fly backwards. I don't see how they can do that without a rearview mirror, but they do. This is what a hummingbird looks like when it's frozen. <laughs> Anyhow, uh, I was gone for a couple of days, and when I left, the hummingbird feeder was about half full. And, uh, you know, I figured that that would probably last them. But when I came in this morning, there was a note tagged on the uh, feeder. And it says, more juice, please. Well, uh, spelling is atrocious, but at least their communication skills are improving. But, yeah, this thing was bone dry. I uh, fixed them up another batch of juice and it took them no time at all to find it and we we get anywhere from you know two or three at a time we've counted seven so when there's seven there feeding it's just anarchy well that's it for the miscellaneous stuff that's been going on around here we haven't seen any bears or mountain lions or uh, uh, lynxes or anything cool yet but uh, there's still time. See ya!